I think the reason why he really got traded because AD couldn't stay on the court, and he, you know, what I'm saying AD could have made his made his game a lot easier. Mm-hmm. You know, if he, if he could just come down and facilitate the LeBron and AD, like how you said, go to the rack. That's a lot more free throw mm-hmm. attempt. You know what I mean? That's a lot more See, free throw I, attempt. I, I, and I agree with I agree with you because when yeah. at the beginning of the season, when everyone was uh, like on Russ and talking about he was he was good and all that stuff, mm-hmm. is when AD he was throwing lost to AD all day, yeah. and that was also when LeBron was at the lineup. But yep. Russ being so ball dominant, like that, you know he can't let go of the ball. Paul George and Kawhi, they could play with him, not not how holding the ball. They can do that, and they'll still be able to get their touches because yeah. clearly we know basketball is just Russ is not letting out the ball one hundred percent of the game. We know that. So and you still take pressure off them guys too. Like that's yeah. like even whatever kind of version of Westbrook they gonna get in the in the Clippers, they just they mm-hmm. need they might need just that much pressure to get off Kawhi and Paul George a little bit. Like because you worry about them yeah. so much. Weber might still drop 30 on you. He's still going to drop 30 on you, bro. We can finally see.